Here's our political correspondent, Jonathan Blake. Stick with it was the message from number 10 as a legal deadline looms for restrictions on movement to be reviewed next week. All indications are that it is too soon to expect them to be lifted or relaxed. There are signs that the rate of new cases of coronavirus being detected is slowing. But the health minister, Edward Arger, said changes could only come after the peak of cases had been reached. The mayor of London, Sadiq Khan, said he thought the lockdown was nowhere near being lifted. The Welsh First Minister, Mark Drakeford, said measures in place there would not end next week. And he expected other parts of the UK to follow. How long's that been? Up there. Huh? How long's that wallpaper been up there? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Not long. Years? Twenty? Five or six. Five or six? That's not too bad then. We don't smoke, so it ain't gone, uh, you know, black or anything, has it? Downing Street says Boris Johnson is responding to treatment for coronavirus after he spent a second night in intensive care. The Prime Minister is said to be in good spirits in St Thomas's Hospital in London. The Chairman of the Health and Social Care Select Committee, Jeremy Hunt, says the signs are positive. The most critical period when you go into intensive care is the first 24 hours. And if someone is stable after that period, then the chances of them making a full recovery are much higher. And so the fact that he appears to be stable from everything we're hearing, appears to be in good spirits, is conscious, is not on a ventilator, is, I think, very encouraging. Been there again. So it's... Oh, it seems to be been there every day of the bloody week this summer. We're getting through a lot of stuff, I'm afraid. I don't know why. Yeah. I'm not saying thank you for all your help so far. Please continue to think of others and don't bother with me. Remember to keep a safe two meters of distance from everyone else, and if possible, consider contactless payments or pay by car. Respect our NHS workers and vulnerable customers by not shopping during their exclusive hour, and please be kind and considerate to our clients. Thank you. Cousin soap, Imperial Leather, in the whole shop. We can get stuck if we don't get that, especially with your skin. With you, you know, because she was sick of the bush. Two barley wines. I've been paying for them ever since. <laughs> Heard you right, Sydney. If you've got her drunk for your own needle purposes, you should rely on judo like a gentleman. You are. Shall I tell you what you got from me that day? It was a lawn of my best hand you. Yeah, Jack. I bet he's a raving monster, this one. No lass will be safe with him. Uh, Mabel thought. Where could you go? Anyway, how would I had a good flatten all four of us with one hand doing a baking? <laughs> She's a nice lass, is that? How would you know? You're only... That's keys. Yeah, yeah. Hello. Then. Somebody a good drum, then. <laughs> I can't hear anybody. Not quite. On the time yet, though. Sounds like somebody's banging a can or something. Yeah, everybody oh, they is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well. 
We all ready. Squeak as well. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Poochie's having a squeak. Okay. Have a squeak, kid. No, I can squeak. Good squeak. Blowing their own spit sounds. Hey, but dog's having a go, he's having a squeak here. Yeah. He's having a squeak. He's having a squeak. Yeah, I think it's all gone quiet. <laughs> hey! Awesome. Don't blame me, blame your mum. You can lie there all day, right? But your mum wants a coffee, so I've got to get up and disturb you. Because your mum's not going to make a coffee. Don't! You wag your tail at me, my friend. 